I'm Alex Marshalluk. I'll be a junior at the University of Michigan in the fall, and I'm the captain of M Racing, the Formula SAE team here. We do a full design, build, and test cycle each year with a Formula One style vehicle. It's about a third of the Formula One uh, scale. Then we manufacture 75% of the parts in-house. And what we can't do because we're limited by capabilities, we'll send out to sponsors. The two types of sponsors we have um, either give us things or services or, or money. Like Seco in, in specific, they, they're kind enough to give, give us a lot of tools for both the lathe and the mill. And without them, we wouldn't be able to make as good of a car just because we wouldn't have the capabilities to do that. So we'll send Seco a list of, of tools that we'd like and we have a, a certain budget that we're allowed to use and whatever fits under that budget they, they will send to us. So we're able to get the best of the best if we want or if we want to step it down to the more uh, the budget uh, economical levels we get more we can so we have full control. So this past year we, we got about around 20 end mills and 60 inserts for the lathe. Uh, we tend to use a lot of the lathe stuff more often because uh, we've, we have tools from the past. Um, but when we do use the mill and such, we are able to use an agri cutter, which we're pretty happy with. Um, but on the lathe side, we're able to get really nice finishes and any material that I've thrown at it. I know the Seco website gives a pretty good recommendation on feeds and speeds, dependent on the material, which is a good starting point and helps out getting a nice surface finish. Our turnaround time from the end of design happens in October-ish, and then we'll, uh, we want to have a car driving in March, so we have to have all of, all of our parts made by March. And then after, once that happens, we can start building spares for competition when things break, which they will, um, so we can swap it out immediately and keep driving and testing the car to get the best performance out of it possible. I think uh, manufacturing experience is paramount to the education of an engineer because you can design a crazy part to do exactly what you need, but if you can't make it, just waste the time and effort. There's no point in designing it. What this allows you to do is understand what can and cannot be made with various uh, techniques and manufacturing machines. If it wasn't for our sponsors like Seco, we wouldn't be able to have as good of a car as we do now, because uh, if we had to go back to conventional tooling, we would have increased cycle times. We'd be here for a lot longer. and might not have all the parts done in time for the car to race, so we have to reduce the number of parts we do, which would uh, decrease the performance of the car. So with Seco, we're able to increase the performance and compete better and faster and, and win.